This is a quick instructional video on the Eldebo. It's an electric deck boat that we have for our guests to use at Abbey Shores. This is a 12 foot electric deck boat, max capacity is six people. Uh, it's a fairly simple boat, but there are a couple things to know. Uh, it's a 24 volt system. There are two banks of batteries. Uh, the middle seats on each side here have the batteries in them. There are four batteries. There's a switch right here. Uh, you should leave it off if you're not using the boat. Turn the switch on when you're ready to use it. Uh, there's one under that seat as well that does the same thing. You'll see that there's a gauge right here. Right now we have about 25 and a half volts of power, so it's fully charged. If it gets down into the recharge area, you're going to want to head back to the dock and recharge it. Uh, the big thing here is where the dock is, it's fairly shallow water. And the motor is actually located underneath the center armrest. So if we look down inside here, this is actually the motor right here. And it's, it's going to hit the bottom if you turn it on while it's sitting at the dock. So the easiest thing to do is to pull up on that motor. And then you can engage reverse very gently to get you away from the dock. You'll see there's little slots right there and there's little ears on this handle. They have to fit into that and then the steering mechanism works. So make sure you get that engaged. Um, but make sure that you pull that up before you turn the, the prop on or you'll wreck the prop. Uh, to move the bolt, you simply turn the knob to reverse or to forward. Uh, do not turn the knob all the way full power. Uh, if you do full power on the throttle control, will drain the batteries very quickly. Uh, so you're not going to go that much faster if you make it go full speed, but you'll lose a ton of battery power. Um, I would make sure that you leave all the lights off and leave the bilge off uh, just to maintain as much battery power as you can. Uh, make sure that everybody has a life jacket. If you're 12 or younger, you need to be wearing it. But if you're over 12, you can just have it on the boat. Those are available in the detached garage. And then uh, there is an anchor on the boat. And just make sure it's securely chained to the dock, front and back, when you go to dock it. Any questions, give